On the banks of the River Weaver, in the heart of the Cheshire countryside, lies the town of Winsford. Famous for its salt, it grew and prospered in the 18th century. Salt also provided Winsford with the flushes when collapsed salt caverns filled with water from the River Weaver, a feature of outstanding beauty and a wonderful habitat for wildlife. Today, Winsford is a successful town. But on the 23rd of March, 2020, Winsford and the whole of Britain went into lockdown. People were suddenly cut off from their family and friends and key workers became heroes. And this film tells how people coped in lockdown. Mark Jewell is headmaster at the High Street Primary. Well, being a key worker during lockdown has, has been a very difficult time for all. But what it also meant is that we were even more in isolation and therefore we had to try and make sure that we met each other virtually on a regular basis to try and support each other in that time. We're always optimistic to see the children. Um, it's lovely to see them, uh, their faces, their well-being, the way they lighten up the place is what makes being a teacher. Young producer Laurel tells us what lockdown was like for her. During lockdown, I used Zoom and Facebook Messenger. I used Zoom to communicate with the Winsford young producers and a couple other people. Going back to school part-time was exciting for me because I could get that extra bit of help, but I could also see my friends that I hadn't seen in ages. Young producer Tom. Um, it was really stressful doing my schoolwork at home because I'm not the best with computers. So I was really out of my comfort zone. Yeah, I was, I'm really close with my grandparents. So it was really weird kind of not seeing them every day like I used to. It was great like seeing my grandparents for the first time because like for months I hadn't seen them at all. So it was just like something that I kind of looked forward to quite a lot. ex Winsford salt miner and counsellor, Brian Clark. It was frightening. Never been locked down in my life. Never known, I always helped other people. And then all of a sudden it come to the time when you were classed as one of the vulnerable and you're the lockdown and other people having to help you. For those struggling with lockdown issues, help is at hand. Claire Fox is from Mid Cheshire Mind. Our own little community based here at, at Mid Cheshire Mind has certainly come up trumps and people have been a lot more resilient than we thought, but they're only a small part of a large community in Winsford. And, uh, and people have told me that they've had help from food banks, from the churches, from other people like that. So I think it's been very important. People like Emma and Jay from Winsford Community Festivals. We are filling a pencil case for back to school. We are aware with obviously COVID-19 that there are a lot of job losses. So there are parents out there that can't afford pencil cases that children this year will go without, but not without our help. If we can help, we want every child in Winsford to go to school this year with a pencil case. It just shows what a community is and it shows that community spirit is there still. Alan Aston runs Al's place in the centre of town. Covid-19 really affected the business. I had to go total shut down for five weeks. Um, then I reopened the takeaway but the restaurant will remain shut for just over three and a half months. We're a hub to the community so people meet, friends, family, so on and so forth. Um, we feel that we're a great benefit to getting people together. It's fantastic seeing that old faces are coming back and some new ones um, and slowly bringing the community out of the front door um, and into businesses like this. Heritage and community run strong in Winsford as people look to the future and hope rises. This lockdown ain't bringing us down. You know, we're gonna, we're rising above it and we're coming back stronger. It's giving me hope that we can come out of lockdown and Winsford is going to be absolutely brilliant. It's going to come out of this stronger than it was before. So Winsford is now coming back to what it was 50, 60 years ago, a community. Music